These are nice salmon. Yep, that's not bad. Right up over my head. There we go. There we go. Oh, oh, there he goes. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Off he goes. Well, today we're out on this pond. We tried, I don't know, it was like two weeks ago. It was awfully cold. We saw one fish rise and we didn't get no bites. Uh, didn't have nothing for a video, so we just scratched it. Been here twice since then, myself and once with my buddy. He caught a nice salmon. We were trolling lead core with smelts and dodgers. And that uh, was about a three pound fish, a real nice fish. And uh, I didn't catch nothing that day. We came back, I came back myself, I think it was yesterday. And I had a salmon on. I wasn't able to get him in the net, got tangled up in my second line, which was a mess. It took me about a half an hour to untangle it. Uh, I got back going and it was about three hours later. I got in some lake trout. Uh, I saw him on the fish finder and I was about three colors out. So I dropped two more colors down to him. And once I was there, I left it on free spool with a clicker on. I just let out a foot of line three times in a row. And after I did it the third time, I got hooked up. Reeled him in, it was about an 18 inch lake trout. And I did that twice in a row. And I'm wondering if I didn't figure out just how to use the dodgers with my boat uh, get it going the right speed and keep them on the right water depth hopefully with any luck we'll be able to pull in a couple nice salmon and maybe a few lake trout time will tell first fish of the day Oh, by the way, where was that at? <laughs> right on the surface. <laughs> ah, he's not as big as I thought. He's a nice salmon. Yep, that's not bad. Right up over my head. There we there go. go. That's how a net is supposed to go. Yeah. I don't think I got that. Whoop, hook come out already. <laughs> Bed, probably 16, 18 inches, huh? Yeah. There we are. Let's get a quick picture of him. Ooh, camera. Whoops. <laughs> that one's going too. Yep. Not bad. What, 16, 8, probably 18, huh? Yeah, something All like right, that. Let's put him back in the water. Grab yeah. a camera. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Off he goes. So how deep are you going to run your lure next time? On the surface. <laughs> <laughs> He's been running, what, 40, 50 feet? Yep, trying to catch another lake trout. Yeah. Ah, awesome. Yes, and then, sir. And that, let me just uh, show yep. you real quick here. Yeah, we're using the uh, dodges. And we've got, what do you call these, sliding? Sliding bait rig. Sliding bait rig. Uh, just uh, hook this one on the uh, head of the smelt and this back by his belly. Hold still for that. See how that slides back and forth? Actually, uh, oh, hooked myself. We'll just rig this up real quick. Just hook that one right there. And this one here, right up underneath is between his two gill plates up into his nose. Just like that. Oops. All right. Oh, All right. Finally hooked up on my first fish. Good. And that was uh, down 50 feet. Yep, I just marked that fish. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, small linker. A lot of fish. 
Yes, sir. Hey, we're on a roll now. Yes, sir. Small lake trout and a salmon. Yes, sir. Getting pliers right here. Smaller than average here, but oh, oh. <laughs> off he goes. What do you quick call release. that? <laughs> Another quick release. Yes, sir. <laughs> All slime. At least I didn't get skunked again. Yeah. Well, we ain't doing bad. What is what time is it? It's uh 719. Yeah, We're that's... smashing the fish this morning <laughs> by our standards. Definitely smashing them. Yeah. Maybe we're for a good day. Yep, we'll see how it goes. Uh, most of our bait died off overnight, but uh, we have a few live pieces left and some all right looking dead bait. We'll see what happens. Well, I just kind of want to explain what I did on that last fish. We were going along and it was about 50 feet deep, dropped off to about 62 feet. And I noticed there was a mark down there about five feet off bottom. And I was running two colors roughly about 15 to 25 feet under the water. So I let out three more colors and got down there. And just as it got down there, it literally made one or two ticks and fish came right up and slammed it. it was nice. Just saw some more fish. Spending down 50 feet and one coming up off bottom dropping down to him. See if we can't pick him up Might not be able to get down there in time As you can see we're only trolling 0.8 miles an hour We got a little bit of wind pushing us down the lake So I'm trolling a bucket to keep us at the speed Still marking more fish. Yeah, there's the tail end of them there. Man, doesn't look like you're gonna get that one. New. Nope. Might not have been able to get it down there quick enough. Yeah. The wind picked up a little bit, and uh, I don't want to kill my batteries first thing in the morning. It's still only eight o'clock. Uh, Finally got the big motor tuned up and uh, she seems to be running pretty well. The wind's coming right down the lake at us. Uh, but we do want to go quite a ways. So to use the trolling motor with the batteries, it'd be horrible. It really would. It'd suck them right dry, probably within a half mile, three miles max. It'd be, we'll be, we'd be done. Anyway, here he is. <laughs> Fish wrangler. <laughs> Back in the water he goes. What a cluster that was. <laughs> Didn't 
didn't hit record on the audio. Oh no. <laughs> And I forgot to flip the switch there and backlashed it when I went to set the hook. What a mess. Well, we got to straighten out anyway. Quicker than I thought. <laughs> I thought it was going to be a big mess. Yeah. Uh oh, we got some rogue waves coming in. Yeah, we do. Wind's picking up. Anyway, fishing. Now, no more backlash. Are you serious? Oh, that was a lot of water we just took. Holy! Man, I wish I would have got that on film. This fish just ripped out the line. Oh, nice salmon! Nice yeah. salmon. That's there how you go. do a net job. There you go. That's a nice one, buddy. Yes, sir. Is your line in the boat? Yes. Right. Yep. Nice fish. Yes, sir. No, nope. don't die on me, motor. Actually, probably be good. Huh? Just turn it off for a second. Yeah. Yeah. That's a nice salmon. Yeah. I mean, it isn't a monster, but I mean, that's probably a three pound fish, huh? Two and a half, yeah, three pounds? some weight to them. Yeah. Come on, fish. Uh, finally. Dip it if you can. That's a nice fish. Yes, sir. Yep. Yeah. Huh? Boat time. <laughs> I've been waiting for a salmon for a while now. Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna put him right back. There. So now, so now let's just uh, discuss a little bit. So I got a brookie, a brown, a lake trout, and a salmon so far this year. Yeah, doing pretty good on the variety. Oh, that wasn't the topic I was meaning for you to talk about. Oh, what was that? Would we just get done discussing? Oh, <laughs> you, I, I have no recollection of what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah. So dad was just getting on me for fishing out in no man's land. Uh, we have caught a few fish out there, but uh, we moved in on a 30 foot shelf on shore and uh, wouldn't you know it, caught a salmon. <laughs> yeah. Maybe dad knows a thing or two yeah. about a thing or two. <laughs> What do we got? Nice, nice salmon. Ah, no, lake trout. Lake trout, huh? What are you doing catching them? Not intentional. Well, I guess we'll take it. <laughs> yeah, it's been quite the dry spell. A little bit smaller than average. Uh, come on, fish. We'll see uh, how you release this one. Yeah. Whoop. Just like that. <laughs> you are gifted when it comes to releasing fish. <laughs> yes, sir. Watch you. Yeah, I got it hooked up. Well, I guess uh, that's better than nothing. I like the salmon, but I guess I can't choose when I'm begging for a fish. Yeah, we'll take it. It's been what? Like a, at least an hour and a half. Yeah, yeah. Awfully slow. Yep. Yeah. I don't know why. Perfect weather. Wind <laughs> blowing. Rain. About Beautiful. Like, about 45 degrees if we're lucky. Yeah. We got just as much gear as we had on in the last video. <laughs> yeah. It's been a couple weeks. Yeah. yeah. Start up with the, uh, I had the audio on. So go ahead. Audio is dead. 
Oh, finally hooked up on a fish. Feels like nice salmon. Bucket. Yep. Oh, there he goes. Chase it down. <laughs> oh, look at that. No, look at that. We might need that. Yeah. Yeah, there's that five pounder bag. Oh, it ain't five. Point three. Four won't he? That's a uh, five pound fish. Maybe, maybe four. <laughs> maybe five. That's, that's a, a nice one. That's a nice fish. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Finally caught another fish there. Uh, seems like you're kicking my butt there, buddy. Uh, that's a nice fish. That's a cocker. Watch. Let me uh, get the hook out of him there and then. Uh, yeah. We'll get him weighed. Dust, 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 dust. It is dead, too. Yeah. 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 Turn it around. See it. Oh. You're right on the dock. Four pounds. Four one. Damn. Let's hold that up there so we can see it. Four pounds, you said? Right on the butt. Yep. That's a nice fish. Yep. Nice fish. About time. You gotta put him all on this side? Yep. Yes, sir. Way to go, buddy. Yes, sir. That's actually, I think, my biggest salmon I've landed. Yep, that's a nice yeah. one. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Good job. Well, our audio died. It's the end of the day. We've had a great day, I think. Uh, it's not like we hammered a bunch of fish, but we did get a really nice fish, a couple other decent fish, a couple small fish, and also uh, a couple Lakers. Overall, I think it's a great day. All of our batteries are dead, so uh, we're going to cut it short here and uh, see you next time. Uh, if you enjoy what you see, please like and subscribe on Facebook and YouTube.